Okay, good afternoon. Welcome to Robbie's Fanatics TV with me, AJ, and Christian. And today, coming to you live from the Tiger Stadium in Brighton Sea, where we're here for the pitching and instrument league game between Brighton Sea Region and Carshaw and Athletic. Uh, it's the furthest one on the route for, uh, for the Robins, but uh, had a quite pleasant journey up here. It's been quite good. Uh, as far as the league table is concerned at the moment, Carshaw is still sitting in ninth. And uh, Brighton Sea Region are sitting third from bottom in 18th place. So let's hope we don't take this lightly. Um, what are your feelings on the, uh, on the game today, Christian? What do you reckon? Well, it's almost a new feeling for us, AJ, to be honest, because I think we've now conceded the fact that we're not going to make the playoffs this yeah. season. So certainly a new feeling for me as, as a supporter. Since 2017, I've only known us either to win the league <laughs> or be in the playoff situation. So it's a bizarre You're lucky. One. I've seen a so lot more than that. <laughs> <laughs> but today... Um, I think there's uh, some new faces, isn't there? There's, yeah, um, there's two new faces, two new in, the faces in the team, and I think Peter wants to try out some of our uh, fringe players and academy players today. Yeah. So it'll be interesting to see what the future's going to look like. But of course, obviously, we've got a number of experienced players, including the boss himself, who's starting. Yeah. So yeah. yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It's a lovely day as well. Let's see what happens. Yeah, I mean, I mean we've really, we played them at Colson Avenue in the league uh, back in uh, November, it was, and we beat them 6 1. So um, hopefully, we won't get taken as lightly as that. I think they might have had some changes in the squad since then. But I'm um, still confident that we should be able to get a positive result here. I mean, they their last results, obviously, Cushel had a one-year defeat at the home to Bogna Regis on Monday night. Yeah. But Brighton C managed a credible 2-2 draw with folks doing in Victor. So um, it's going to be no easy game today. So, um, you know, as for the team news, I mean, made three changes from a uh, defeat of Bogna. Uh, seems like we're playing three at the back with in backs, and um, you know, sort of just giving it a, a little bit of a change around, a bit of a refresh. Yes. So, um, mm. so I'm going to go for a score prediction. I'm going to not be too cocky about this, I'll, but I do think I shall win two-one. What about you, Christian? What do you reckon? Um, I'm going to go with a bit of a scoring game. 3 2 to Carl Shilton. 3 2. Oh, mm. Expecting a goal feast, are you? Mm. I suppose with our defence, it's quite, quite reasonable yeah, to say. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah so um, yeah, anyway, hopefully it'll be a good game anyway. Hopefully, um, Carl Shilton will turn up today and put in a good performance. Yeah. And, um, We've come all this way. Yeah. It's a shame not to. Yeah, it's a long way to come. Mm. Like I say, it's the longest trip we have in the uh, East yeah. Wind League. But it's an enjoyable one, though. So. Let's see how it goes. Definitely. Uh, we'll be back at half time with a roundup of how it's gone. Hopefully, I'll have some highlights on this uh, bit later on. And um, that's it. So, until half time, see you later. Go on, you Robins. Go on, you Robins. Shit, here's a go, isn't it? Oh, oh my good right. God. How has he missed that? Go on, H. Go on, H. Oh, Pete. Oh, 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 oh. stop. Go on, new boy. Hit it! Bang it! Oh! What the score? Go on, Bass! <laughs> Love that. Get him up, get him up. That's the ball. Go on! I told you, that's Joe Wilkes for. Hit it! Bang it! Go on! Oh, oh Harry! <laughs> Go on, Danny! Come on! Come on! Yeah! There's yeah. some Bass stands on the keep oh, instead of. And he actually got the header. Oh, that's far for a reason. Whoa, tackle! Good defence, he called again something. Stand up! Oh, that's still there, still there. Oh, that's it. 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 Give it out to him so he can cross it in. So fucking scary. Just like, you want to keep it? That's it. Keeper's got that. Someone's got a little bit of work. He's had a good day out. Don't pay your own free kick. And they scored last second. Get out of the open, you've got it. Go on. Pete! Oh, lucky Pete! Didn't touch him! Didn't touch him! Oh, well, not a second then. 
Barrett and I have all three. Obviously Bradley. No, they're all in between Jay. Well, that wasn't great. Now in the box up. Oh, good effort, Beto. in the relegation fight the last time was East Thurrock wasn't it and yeah. I think it's a much better showing yeah. there yeah. against East Thurrock so we can take that as positive definitely so yeah. they had a few chances pitch is a bit wobbly but yeah yeah, it just help the team but it's, it's a thing on both sides really isn't it, yeah. um, it. Um, we've had a couple of half chances really but keep the sort of feed to lead and them up yeah. and uh, they've had spells and they've sort of looked like dangerous and they have on one of our free kicks, which I nearly caught it from. But, um, that, the build up play's been great. Yeah, the build up play's been great. It's just a lot of fun. I've never seen it. It's all great. So, uh, hopefully, but that's eight. It's nearly all half time, so all good. So, hopefully, in the second half, we can come back and uh, get a goal to get the three points. Yeah, definitely. So, uh, let's hope. Just keep working hard. Just yeah. keep working hard and see what happens from it. Okay. okay. All right then. See you later. Come here, Robs. Come here, Robs. Good save. Can help, boys. Direct from there. <laughs> we'll be lucky. Oh, unlucky. Corner! No, boys, come on! Oh, 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Have we made any subs? Oh, have a go! Have a go! Oh, unlucky. I feel that East Thurrock United moment coming here. I don't know why. Come on, boys. Please. Oh, and that's it. So I'm here at Brighton Sea Region. It's finished Brighton Sea Region nil, Car Shorten nil. Um, Brighton Sea Region would probably be pleased with that point really, wouldn't they? I mean they'd better of it in the second half. Uh, certainly um, Lloyd was busier than their goalkeeper, what do you reckon, Christian? Yeah, I'll say. You know, I don't know if it was the second half uh, as we did the first half, we had more chances in that. We didn't really sort of trouble their keeper though. In this half, maybe in the last five minutes we had a few chances, but yeah. largely it didn't seem to go our way. Bounces, we weren't winning headers, we were making mistakes, we were the ball, bobbles were affecting us. But Yeah, the pitch was, the pitch was not great. It's no, like, but yeah, that's what you're going to find. We can't yeah. really use that as an excuse. We've lost no. two games in a row on our pitch, yeah. which is like a carpet basically, yeah. so yeah. it's not really... It, we can't really sort of say much about that. I just think, you know, we're still building our form back, aren't we? After, yeah. you know, major disappointments, we're no longer in the running for any of the playoff places and stuff like that. It's changing, isn't it? So yeah, it's just it's got a sort of a feel of the end of season. Sort it's of like one. a new objective kind of thing. Yeah. Now. It's got a new objective to try out new players and stuff yeah. and, you know, consolidate our position, I suppose. Yeah, you know. yeah, it just sort of feels like the summer holidays have started yeah. already, you know what I mean? It's um, a few, you know, it was a, not a bad performance, it wasn't awful really, compared to what we've had in the past. No, recent games, but Still, it's a clean sheet. Clean you know, sheet. you've got when you're down and your form's down, you've got to start somewhere. Yeah, a draw away and not conceding a goal is a start. Yeah. So let's just see how we take that forward against the next game. Is it against Hornchurch next week? Hornchurch next week. Yeah, that's at home. And, so um, let's see what happens. Yeah, it's just the thing is, we've played this on home for six passes, we but we can't even put one pass in today. So and they look like more likely to score than we did. Yeah. So, uh, I mean, they'll probably be pleased with the point. They might think they deserve three. You can be really forward for that. No, but, uh, I totally agree with you. Totally. Uh, happy, well, happy with the point, but you know, it's better than nothing, so we've just got yeah. to just build on it and move on to uh, uh, Hornchurch next Saturday, like Christian said. So, um, yeah, let's have Harry back in the game. Harry made a difference, today. yep, 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 played well, yep. yep. Um, Lloyd made a few saves in the second half as well. Yeah. Uh, I think we missed Tommy today in midfield. We I think did. a little bit of uh, yeah. sharpness in midfield was missing today. Mm. Um, but, I'd uh, like to have seen Ore come on and yeah. maybe the other uh, new signing that we've got. Yeah, yeah, just give them a go. I mean, yeah. you know, I mean they, they brought four you youngsters with us and we didn't really use them, which was a bit of a shame, really. You know, yeah. Might have, yeah, might not have been able to do too much, but you know, give them experience you know, to build on for the rest of the season. Mm. But uh, there you go. It's a point, it's a point shared, it's nil-nil. Mm. Uh, we'll just have to cope with that and just um, build on again for next week. Yep. All right, then. Long that's journey home. Long journey home time now. So uh, that's it for me and Christian from Robbins and Angus TV. We'll be back soon. And until then, see you later. Come on, you, Robbins. Come on, you, Robbins.